was 1022 when somehow I knew today I'd be breaking a major story. You see, we newsroom boys make a lot of noise if we don't get our share of the glory. A call came through, it was the government who said the premier was planting a tree. And did I know? Well, I jumped to my feet, ready to dig real deep, because you got a right to know. You got a right. You got a right to know. You got a right. You got a right to know. I hopped in the car on the way it was hard Not to think, was this tree NDP or Tory? And what's with the press? Were we doing our best at digging up the real story? I was hungry for clues and answers meant news Like, what's with that tree, Mr. Roman? No So I sniffed and I wrote, prodded and poked Cause you got a right to know You got a right You got a right to know You got a right You got a right to know it was a busy day, and the boss called to say, could I follow yet another story? Doggies, it seems, were telling folks their dreams after peeing on morning glory. Now, facts are facts, and when you're on track, you can find out most anything in mole. And with my nose to the ground, I'm like an old bloodhound, because you got a right to know. But I was running late for the deadline date. The clock showed six minutes to go. The editing suite was abuzz with the beat of a man getting ready to blow. The pressure was hot, but I couldn't stop. I had to get the story to air. The editor screamed and sweat it gleamed on my face as we laid the story bare. No time to quibble, I started to scribble. With seconds left, I made it a go. And at the top of the clock, we ran with the dock, because you got a right to know. At a special tree planting ceremony in Saskatoon today, the Premier said it was time dogs of all breeds had a chance to celebrate their dogness together. After dancing in a circle and digging holes in the ground, Mr. Romano said there were far too few communal trees for dogs in the city, and some breeds had been expressing their frustration. Like a terrier, uh, fastening onto our leg for everything that we do and, and attacking it. That just won't do, says the Premier. And so, with more plantings due soon, these new communal pea trees should give Fido the leg up he deserves. Scoop Baron, CBC News.